So, uh, so that year I won won the grand prize. <laughs> but I mean, uh, I've uh, uh, been eclipsed in this by far later on by uh, uh, Francois Bellard, who wrote a tiny C compiler, because he wrote a C compiler to machine code that he won the obfuscated C code contest with a few years later. But I um, mean, I, I spent a lot of time on this uh, C compiler thing. It was stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I wrote the peephole optimizer for the bytecode that was written in Haskell, of course. Well, yeah. Uh, it seems like you, you really get fun out of, of doing these things. Huh? Oh, yes. I mean, and it's it's a challenge. You have this many bytes. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh I, I forgot to say, you also, you're also allowed a command line to compile your program that can be maybe 128 bytes. I can't, can't remember. So you can put a lot of your program in minus D flags to have define, extra defines for, so, uh, I mean, uh, Maybe ten percent of the code was actually on the <laughs> FMA. <laughs> that's a huge command. Wow, that's really cool. That's 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 very very interesting. So um, you also have a, a very um, you've been around in the industry. You've been a professor. You've been around in the industry. You've worked for banks. You've worked uh, on a bunch of stuff. How do you see? I mean, a lot of times, especially in the industry, you have to make compromises, right? Like. You have, you have your manager, you have people above you wanting things in a certain way or wanting things to be finished earlier than you're able to finish things. Um, so there is, there is this, this tension, right, between getting things done, being practical and making good software, beautiful software, or even, you know, like theoretically pleasant stuff. How does that come up in your, in your career?